we have seen this how the string objects is being created and all some questions are there and that is being asked most of the time in interviews what is that question is the question is suppose for the s1 reference the question is how many objects will be created at this point of time right here if anybody is asking the when you are now you have to remember one point that where you have written this statement is that it is your first statement or before that also you have written some statements so if it is your first statement and before that you have not used anywhere jtc literal then for this two objects are being created which means one is inside the pool and one is outside the pool when we talk about s2 <coughs> in the case of s2 the one if it is already there so it is not creating inside the pool but it is creating only the outside the pool so hope it is yeah, you are clear with this like how it is creating inside the pool or outside the pool we'll come to the other also other points also in the concatenation like how we are performing and all now we are going to see creating string objects without new keyword like what how it is there in the case of without new keyword how we are creating the string objects for example so the whenever we are creating string object without word so in that some points are there which is very very important like we are creating here so again i am writing here string object without new operator is it okay now see first it is just as it is like the similar to the previous one itself in that but one small changes are there like see i am creating one string object string of s1 is equal to something i am writing som one string object which i have created without new operator i have created one more thing you need to notice here that the case sensitivity of these letters also will vary from there so here first points in that first is this is your string constant sorry it's your heap memory inside the heap memory scp is there string constant pool is there we already know this is one part of the heap or you can say it is an special memory location now here when i have created object with or without new operator in that first thing which it is doing is it checks inside the string constant pool whether that literal som is there inside the string constant pool or not if that literal is available inside string constant pool or first if that literal is not available inside string constant pool so it will create one literal inside the string constant pool that it has created fine and one more thing this is without new operator right so once it has created inside the pool so next time it is not going to create outside the string constant pool right and this reference itself will be assigned to the s1 reference variable is it okay but the second time so this is first first is what now when that string literal is not there inside the string constant pool so it will create one literal inside the string constant pool that reference will be assigned to the reference variable s1 and it is not going to create a another string literal outside the string constant pool clear next point again that if second one when i am creating one more object understand it s2 actually you will understand here what is the reusability of a string objects so here if i am writing again som i am writing understand here so again in this case also it will go and check whether the string literal is there that is som is there inside the string constant pool or not is it there is that string literal is available inside string constant pool okay it is already there so it is not going to create a new string literal inside the string constant pool and the same literal reference will be assigned to the reference variable so by this diagram one thing which is very clear that 
what is that clear s1 and s2 both if you are comparing so it will return by the address wise also both are the same and by the content wise both are the same now in this case you can ask some questions the question what you can ask is how many total number of objects are being created the total number of objects in the first case is being created only one and in the second case if that already literal is available so the same existing literal is being referenced by the s2 it's not creating a new object so there is now two points now we have seen two things here i'll just rub it out is it clear now so in that now i'm making it more one more point very clearly that like you know both what always you know creating string object with new operator you know and without new operator you know right so when i am creating the string object see two things i am considering one is with new operator string object and second one is without which one now new operator we are creating the string object so one is with new operator with new operator and second one is the without new operator where we are creating the string object which one is better for you see in this case it is always and always recommendable to create the string object without new operator why because it is taking less memory first and the things are reusable and there are the benefits of that so always we should be going to create the string object without new operator in that case is that okay now so what we will do now in this we will uh, discuss some more things or some more different kinds of concepts we will discuss here like with the help of concatenation like when we are concatenating one string with the another string then how it is going to do what all the other processing it is going to do so i'll do one thing i'll write some of the statements what all the some of the statements i am writing inside this say for example in this i am writing what i am writing in this now number 1 string s1 string of which one s1 is equal to new of string in that something called as the jtc is available first line i'll be drawing it separately but as such you just understand here second one now here i'm writing the s2 is equal to what next i am writing now new of string in this also i am writing what now jtc i am writing fine third important thing string of s3 is equal to new of string in that i am writing jtc noida i am writing something here and after that at the fourth step now or in the fourth case i am writing a string of s4 is equal to new of string in that what i am writing now noida only i am writing inside this fine it is now now similarly i am combining both of that now the next one what i am going to write here is the string of s5 is equal to string of s5 is equal to i am writing what now jtc i am writing can i write it after that s6 is equal to is equal to i am writing jtc noida i am writing fine and the seventh one is equal to string of s7 is equal to only i am writing here what is that now i am writing noida i am writing right now this one we need to make it very clear like you just see here now inside this now we will be drawing the diagram of this one and on the basis of this diagram here we need to focus it out what is that where see i am drawing the diagram 
it is there like this. Suppose this is your string, uh, what is this now? Heap memory it is available, right? In this heap memory, what exactly we need to understand here or what we need to make it out here? That first, here inside this one, what is there now? It is the string constant pull is available here, fine. Now, first one, S1 I am writing, S1 I am writing, see, S1 it is creating one inside the pool and one more outside the pool, it will point to that. Is it clear? Already you are aware with this. Second one, now when you are writing S2, inside the pool, already it is there, outside the pool it will create and it will point to this, right. Now, when I am talking about S3, so it is creating, what is that it is creating? Noida, again it will create JTC something called as the Noida and it will point to this. Is it okay? Now again, S4 when I am writing, what I am writing S4 now? Noida. So, where is the Noida is available now? Inside the pool it is not there. So, we are writing Noida and one more is the Noida outside the pool also, it will point to this. Is it okay? Now, one question is here. Say for example, we have written this statements only. For example, what we are doing that, we are writing these statements only, we have not written. For example, assume that. So, what will happen in the sketch? See, the objects are the string literals, which is available inside the SCP string constant pool are unreferenced. Can I say that? And if it is unreferenced, so will it be eligible for GC or is that the GC will be able to access it? See, one very important question is, that GC cannot access these unreferenced objects, because GC, it is not coming under the area of GC and GC will not be allowed to access this string constant pool. Even GC is not allowed to enter inside the string constant pool. Okay. So, one thing that is clear. Now, similarly, I am creating, I am writing this by the red, in that what I am writing without new keyword. So, I am writing see here, S5 I am writing. What I am writing now? S5. S5 is which one now? JTC. It will check inside that JTC is it already available. So, JTC if it is already available, so it will point to the JTC. Is it okay? It is not going to create any new literal. S6 it is JTC Noida. JTC Noida where it is? JTC Noida it is there inside the string constant pool, it will point to that, right. Noida where it is now? S7. It is already there inside this, it will point to this. Hope you are getting my point. Is it okay? Now, as I have shown you the complete representations, now I am showing you some concatenation process, like how exactly we are doing this concatenation process. In this first, we will go to this one. For example, suppose, if I am writing here, suppose, what now I am writing? I am writing that is string of S11 for example, is equal to I am writing S1 plus which one now? S4, S1 plus S4, S1 plus S4 I am writing. So, where this is going to create a literal, remember it is reference plus reference concatenation whenever we are doing reference plus reference, then always it is going to create outside the pool, which means now S11 when I am writing, this S11 JTC India it becomes JTC here plus Noida here, so JTC Noida it becomes right, so JTC Noida it is checking, it is already available, so it will create one outside the pool, JTC something Noida it will point to this one, is it okay? Similarly, when S string of S12 is equal to S1, JTC plus I am writing here what I am writing now? Noida. So, S12 is also going to create outside the pool itself JTC Noida. Is it okay here? That is JTC Noida, it is going to create outside the pool itself, right? Next thing now, when I am writing string of S13 is equal to, I am writing what here I am writing now? Literal plus literal I am writing. What I am writing now? I am writing JTC plus Noida I am writing here. So, when I am writing JTC plus Noida, so S13 here, here I will just show you S13, 
right? S13 J literal plus literal it is. So literal plus literal it is. It is always going to point inside the pool itself. So now hope it is clear to you that how all other these processes are being done in the case of string literals, right? How we are creating the string object with new operator, without new operator. What is the processes of concatenation and all? So one very clear point it is. You can. Uh, write it down or you can note it down what is that now that if we are making any that same thing will applicable to this case that if you are writing reference plus which one now reference that will always give you the false false means it is not going to create inside the pool first point second point now reference plus what next I am writing literal, always it is going to give the false. Third one is literal plus reference, always it is going to give the false. And the fourth one is literal plus literal, always it is going to return true, which means that it will create inside the string constant pull. Is it okay? So, one basic thing and the most asked interview things which you have seen in these cases. Is it okay? Now, apart from this, there are some important things about this also that we will see what all the important things 